the young and the restless spoilers. Adam will be at his apartment, shaking from the night before. Phyllis Summers will come and hear the story of how someone tried to control him on Route 7. When it turned out, Adam didn't see anyone driving or pushing him aside, and he was knocked out. Adam would say that he had either eliminated Billy or Kevin as the driver, and Phyllis would suggest that Victor Newman was behind it. When men replayed what was going on, including Christian Newman's detention case. In the end, Adam will yell at Victor for seducing him with his mother's handkerchief and try to knock him down. Victor would firmly refuse to use his mother's memory in that way, and he would say his mother would be ashamed of him now. Phyllis will hold on and complain about her bad day and about how Adam sold the Grand Phoenix to Abby Newman. Irritated, Adam will remind her that someone tried to kill him last night, and he will share and complain about his previous argument with Victor. Phyllis would think it was definitely payback time. Adam will want any repayment against Victor to be profound personal and lasting, and he will comment on the irony of Victor's fraudulent death. And with that, Adam would say that perhaps there was a way to prove to Victor that he was not invincible. So will Adam decide to somehow interfere with the medical treatment that Victor is receiving? It was a bad thought, but it certainly sounded like Adam's mind was walking. Can he plan on Victor's drug delivery with a placebo? Billy Abbott on life Adam Newman, Kevin Fisher and Chloe Mitchell will stand on an unconscious Billy in the cabin. Kevin will remark that they could not take Billy to the hospital for his crimes. Chloe will place a temporary splint on Billy's injured leg, so it looks like he'll be there for a while. And when Billy woke up agitated, Kevin would give him a sedative and the two would leave the cabin. Later, Kevin and Chloe will be at the Crimson Lights when Chelsea Lawson discovers Chloe. She would be completely stunned to see Chloe alive. Her first instinct would be to call the police since Chloe tried to kill Adam. But Chloe would explain that she was arrested for that. Chloe will try to explain how she didn't think about the consequences of her actions in the past. And Delia Abbott's death has pushed her through an emotional side, but Chelsea won't have it. Chelsea will say that fixing their friendship is impossible, leaving Chloe shaken.